self-decapitating sea slugs, can grow an entire new body on the old head. Heads of young Alicia C.F. Marginata sea slugs, can pull themselves free from their bodies, and just keep crawling around while growing a new body. Report ecologists at Nara Women's University in Japan. Within a few hours, some separated heads start nibbling on algae again. Sayaka Mito and Yoichi Yusa report March 8th in Current Biology. And within about 20 days, a third of the young sea slugs they watched, had grown their bodies back, heart and all. The decapitated heads of older slugs, usually died within 10 days. While the younger slugs' heads, began feeding on algae within a few hours, and got to work on a new heart within a week. Three weeks down the line, the regeneration was complete. It's possible the remarkable feat, is facilitated by stem cell-like cells, that have the capacity to become anything in the body. Exactly why they do it is another question, though it could be a means of jettisoning parasitized bodies. The researchers plan to study the slugs, with hopes they'll be able to confirm exactly how, and why such a complex animal, can regrow almost its entire self. Sekuglasan sea slugs eat algae, but they don't just digest it, their bodies incorporate the algae's chloroplasts. Allowing the creatures to photosynthesize, a fascinating phenomenon known as kleptoplasty. This theft is only temporary, the sea slugs have to replenish the chloroplasts, by eating more algae, but the researchers think that being able to photosynthesize, for a short time may keep the heads alive long enough, to regenerate a body. This would also explain, how the bodies are able to keep moving around, for so long without heads to feed them.